This is the dress. Um. You ready? <laughs> This is Will, he's 19 years old. Oh, yeah. This is Jessica, she's 18 years old. I don't like him, and I don't like how he treats you. People say I'm bossy. Everybody needs to turn around, because I always get what I want. You look like a hoe. I don't understand that. Jessica, you're much. asking too much. I want it the way I want it, and that's final. I miss hanging with my boys. They say I'm making a huge mistake. I don't know, man. You can't accept it, bro, and don't be my friend. That's it. If you don't answer my call in the next 10 minutes, I'm not gonna be at the end of the aisle and you can have fun with your self. I hate living here, this sucks. Oh. Are you serious right now? I wonder why, don't hate me. People think we're too young to get married, but we don't care. Take pictures with this pirate. <laughs> okay. You have to do something funny. When people tell us that they think that we're too young to get married, they can kiss our butts. You can't kiss him. Only me. They don't really know the true us. Okay, uh, delete. No, keep it. No, because yeah. you only have you in there. If anybody said that to me, I'd be like, who the f do you think you are? <laughs> tell me that I'm too young. What if they're too old? I was 16 and he was 17. I was, I was 18. You were 17 when we first met. You were just 20. So be quiet. Right, right. Anyways, her. I was walking down the street to go to work, and then what did you say? And I was like, dang, this is the girl of my dreams. I thought he was pretty cute, and I got his number, and then ever since that day, we've been inseparable. Woo! Look at, look at, look at, look at, look at. I'm gonna school you. I'm gonna beat you with this shot, that's for no. sure. I was totally shocked. I've had a talk with Jessica about when marriage does take place, things will change, and your budget is gonna be very tight. You need to start planning now. So you excited for the steak and dough? Yes, as long as there's no fools. There's not gonna be fools. Yeah, there is. No. Yeah, because your friends are weird. I don't know if they're the greatest couple together right now because sometimes Jess doesn't know when to pick her words. We got a call. Hello? Wait, I'll talk to him. Are you uh, coming to help set up? Do you want me to? Yeah? Like, hello, you're the groomsman, and you have to run a game, no ifs, ands, or buts. I don't care what you say. Okay, I'm sort of bossy. If I don't get my way, or if I don't get something that, like, needs to be done my way, then I will freak out and let everybody know, like, the whole world will know. We're going to the next hole now. No, I can't do it. My fingers are too numb. I paid, like, too 20 bad. bucks to play. Too bad. I'm pregnant. I can't do it. You're pregnant, not crippled. We got engaged a year and a half ago, and then in the midst of planning our wedding, we found out we were pregnant. Baby's called fluttering my uterus. <laughs> the baby's fluttering? Yeah. He made me take a pregnancy test in a fast food restaurant, because that's how much he was excited. It's cool. It's Our cool. genes produced. <laughs> it's us, but better. She cried. Definitely. You cried too, so. I didn't cry. You got teary eyes. I got maybe a tear of joy, one or two. <laughs> the only thing I love more is my video games. I currently don't work right now because I'm in college. I currently work with my father, machining parts. We spend a lot of money on pointless things and shopping sprees. Yeah, we do spend more than what we should. She needs a cute little outfit. For the dog? Yeah, for the dog. No, this is cute. We spend our money on our dog, Daisy. Daisy. We buy her clothes, we buy her collars, we buy her leashes. Careful with her. I'm trying to. Daisy. You don't really need that, though. Yeah, yeah I do. do. Bro, like, what happened to you? All right, bro, you wouldn't understand. Our current living situation right now is that we are living in Will's parents' basement. This sucks there. Real bad. 
Well, the garbage is still at the bottom of the stairs. You can I throw know. it out. I've asked you several times now. I've, I'm almost done this game. No, I'm... video games can wait. My dad being my, my boss, my father, and my landlord, he's just bossing me around all the time. That's all it is. You got stuff in the ceiling hanging out. It's been like that for what, five months? That's because I tried to plug it in for the game, so it's fast. It's all about the game. Yeah. Are you saving any money? I'm trying. The wedding's draining me dry. They don't know how good they have it living here rent free. I've tried to tell them to save their money and it just doesn't seem like it works for them. They think because they don't have to pay rent, they get a little bit more money to spend on something else. I pay for you to live here. I pay for your food. I help you out and I get this. I feel I should do it, the chores that my dad tells me to, but sometimes I'm just in the moment and I has to wait until I'm done doing what I'm done doing. Game's over. Get your ass upstairs and take that garbage out for the last time. I hate living here. This sucks. You can't do what you want when you don't pay. Move this flag. I don't want it there. I don't want it there, she said. Today we're here for the steak and dough. Having a steak and dough is definitely another excuse for me and Will to spend time with each other. We're hoping to make around $2,000 so that we can pay off as parents for helping us and so we can get the last minute touch-ups for the wedding that we need. I need some for chili. That looks like puke in a pan. We have good food, we have an open bar, and we make money off of it. Whoever gets closest to the bottle gets the bottle, but you have to try, like, right here? make them do it like five billion times right so we get their money. <laughs> it's okay. You're gonna take our money eventually. Okay, good. Okay. We already have. Brad, do you have My groomsman, Brad, he's one of my best friends. Brad thinks I'm taking away Will from him, but I think Brad is just used to, like, the single Will and out partying all the time and getting smashed where they can't even talk or walk. <laughs> Be careful. Don't get into any fights. I told my bridesmaids to go and find their own bridesmaid dresses. Yeah. It has to be in the red color family and definitely not skimpy or short. Everybody needs to turn around. Okay, Taylor. Taylor is my maid of honor. We've been best friends for seven years. You look like a hoe. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I don't say that. I thought it was gonna be more dressy, like you're made of honor. Taylor's, it's not really dressy enough for the maid of honor. I thought she would stand out a little bit more than the bridesmaids, but apparently not. Jessica needs to zip it. Uh, she wanted me in a red dress, and I'm in a red dress. Amanda, I really love your dress. <laughs> and you don't look like a hoe. You're approved. Alicia, you look like an old lady, sort of. <laughs> Hey, people wear this style of dress now. <laughs> you know, the back is really cute. Yeah, Look at it, with the folds. Yeah. Is there, can you wear it the other way around, like backwards? No, no. Can we see what it looks like? Oh my god. This is not gonna work. Bad idea. Bad idea. I'm definitely the queen bee, because when I say something, all those girls do it. It's actually really good. <laughs> yeah! Queen Jessica, hail me, hail me. Just let me out of the house today to hang with my boy Brad. Me and Will don't get a lot of time to just hang out with the two of us, you know, ever since Jess has been around. We haven't hung out just me and Will since they've been together, actually. So, yeah, he's with. <laughs> Boom! That's game, buddy. Yeah, because I had a rusty-ass day. Rusty-ass day. Hopefully I don't have a rusty-ass day at the wedding. Why? Just friends coming? Yeah. Got some hotties? 
Jess has got you so whipped, you can't even admit if a girl's hot. I don't see any girl the same anymore. Oh, God. Just on, her, man. I'm oh, telling you, bro. My God. I do agree that I am a little bit whipped because I love her and I want to keep her happy. You're gonna play. All right, one nothing. You ready? Yeah. You're gonna have a wife. I know. Sick. It's f***ed up. It's not f***ed up. A couple of my friends think that I should wait to get married. Brad, in particular, he thinks that I'm too young and that he just drugs. wants he just he just, he just wants to party with Will all the time. That's Brad's problem. Fun to party with, which is not happening. So, like when you were a kid, did you think you'd be like 19, getting married, having a kid? No, but things change. There's no chance that I'd be getting married at 19. Why do you feel so bad about me getting married, like? We used to have some good times, man. Yeah, we did. I just don't want, don't want it to like stop, you know what I mean? They won't, they won't. I don't know, man. You don't think so? You don't think it's gonna be the same? No. Why? Because you're gonna have a wife there all the time. You're gonna have a kid. It's, it's just gonna be Can't accept a lot it, different. bro, don't be my friend. That's it. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> I'm not gonna not be your friend. Well, then accept the fact that it's happening and that it's gonna be the same. All right? Okay. I hope you're better at being a husband than you are at this game. <laughs>
This is mine for tonight, all right? In the pocket. I'm extremely annoyed because I know for a fact that Will is definitely playing his video games with his friends, and that's the reason why he's not entering his phone, because when he gets into his game, he ignores everybody around him. Let's drink together, everyone. Yeah. Drink to everybody. Yeah, cheers, boys, cheers. I'm enjoying this bachelor party so much. It's so much fun. We're drinking, talking, having the greatest time ever. Okay, I'm calling him one more time. If he doesn't answer, yes, then I'm not going it. tomorrow. Yes, you are. And now, if you don't answer my call in the next 10 minutes, I'm not going to be at the end of the aisle, and you can have fun with your <gasps> self. Thanks. <gasps> Bye. Thanks, bro, for taking me out, man. It's way better than zombies, that's oh, yeah. for sure. Oh, yeah, man. I just called Will a billion times, and he's not answering his phone. So I looked on Facebook, and Brad's Facebook status says that they decided to have a little party. So me and Taylor are going to crash it. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. If there's f***ing girls here, I'm going to knock them all out, I swear on everything. Oh. Oh. Are you f***ing serious right now? Where's your phone? What phone? Where's your phone? Hey, chill, chill out, chill out, chill out. Where's your phone? This, this phone? Give me that phone right now. Why the f*** do you even have his phone? Oh, Seriously, Jessica shows up to the party. You're a f***ing idiot for putting it on Facebook because I've seen it. I'm a Facebook freak. I'm obviously going to find you. You already look f***ing drunk right now. My biggest fear tomorrow is that Will's going to be hungover and he's going to be puking all over. Yeah, exactly. I wonder why. Don't be me. me. And I've never seen Jessica this mad before, ever in my life. It's the morning of the wedding and I'm super stressed out. Where are you? Check, I'm at the bus stop heading to the fabric store. Just now? You're not there yet? I'm on my way. My veil needs to be perfect. Just get there as fast as you can. Goodbye. Today's the day. Today's the big day. <laughs> Man, chug this. You'll definitely feel better after. We had so much fun yesterday. After the night of partying, we had... Chug, 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 chug. <laughs> Ugh. Actually made me feel worse <laughs> inside. <laughs> now I got a little bit of a headache. You put the coat on before the tie? I think the tie first. I'm feeling very nervous. I don't know what to expect at the wedding. I hope everybody enjoys themselves. Will definitely drank a lot last night, so I'm a little bit worried on how he's gonna be at the end of the aisle. I definitely do not want a hungover groom. I feel like I should be like, on like a beauty pageant. Yeah. <laughs> That's, I should. Hi, honey. Do you like it? Okay, don't cry, don't cry. You're gonna make me cry. Don't, don't look at me. Don't look at me until you're done. <laughs> it's what they had left up, so I've done the best I can to. All by hand, baby. <laughs> and extra rhinestones. I was so worried you that like you that weren't gonna, gonna make it. What do you think, girls? It's so pretty. You did such a good job. Like it, <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. My mom pulled through with the veil, definitely. I'm so happy that she came here on time this morning and that she went and did everything I asked her. Did you guys think I was going to look this fabulous? Yes. yes. <laughs> going to put your dress on backwards? Do you want to see if it looks better? Do you want to get punched in the face? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Been a little bit overwhelmed, but really excited to see my handsome down the aisle. Can we all stand together, please? We are gathered together in the presence of this company to join together William and Jessica in the bonds of holy matrimony. I, William, take you, Jessica, to share the rest of my life with you. I will dedicate my life making you the happiest woman in the world. My love will grow stronger by each woman. I love you. I'm so thankful to have you by my side. I love you and I promise to cherish you through good times and bad. It is my delight to pronounce you husband and wife. If 
feels great to finally be married. All the planning and all the stress is now finally over. I don't know how to do it! Will just got married and I just kind of put myself in his shoes and think like, what would I be doing if I had a wife and I had a kid on the way and I had to deal with all that? It's kind of freaky. Okay. <laughs> I'm happy for them, yet, yeah, but I hope they do good with each other. They're still young. How would they know about true love, you know, when I'm still not married and I know what true love is. Well, hopefully they'll get their stuff together and move out of my basement. You look really super hot today. And you look very sexy, my queen. Queen bee, you better know it, honey. <laughs> <laughs>